Hey, what's up, you guys? Yes, welcome to the bonus episodes of New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe. Last time, we beat the Luigi U campaign, and that means both campaigns are done, which means we have bonus episodes. And for the first bonus episodes, I thought we'd go to the Play With Me section. Oh god, that, that sounded wrong. That's gonna... Okay. So, if we go to the Play With Me section, we have stuff. We have these three modes, and we're just gonna go into slight detail about them. Nothing too much. We're just gonna go over them. So, let's just start with challenges. The title says Play With Me, so you can play with Mario, Luigi, Toad, slash blue toad and me and it has all your me's from your switch or wii u depending on the version you're playing and i'll use my me my me's very outdated it just looks nothing like me anymore so if you flick the joystick you can put a hat on if you're playing with two players well you can't do this in this mode but in a different mode you can play two players with the me and um you can the second player would be green like Luigi, so yeah. And the M stands for me, so uh, let's play as my me, because we can. All right. Why is it taking forever? New challenges available. All right, so there's three types of challenges. Time attack, which is basically speed runs and time trials, yeah. Coin collection, one-up rally, and special, which is pretty much an other category. We're gonna do one of both. All right, so let's just do time um, acorn plane speed run. So this is the first level of the game. It's a speed run. I wish I could show you all the challenges, but I'm not, because that's stupid. So if you get 70 seconds or less, you will get a bronze. 60 seconds or less, you'll get a silver. And 53 seconds or less, and you'll get a gold. So. That doesn't sound that bad. Ah! Oh! Shit. <laughs> Try again? Yes. I suck at this. Okay, I gotta actually just beat the level. <laughs> Stop! I'm not going for a good time. Just show off this shit. Alright. Let's just do this. Guys, I'm so used to the Luigi youth this physics. This is so difficult to me. Oh my god. Okay. <sighs> Let's just do this last time. Wow. Are you fucking kidding me? Why am I so ass? Oh my god. This makes shitty content, man. This content sucks. <laughs> That was pretty bad. And we got a silver. Those physics really don't throw me off. By the way, they're Mario U physics. There's no Luigi U challenges at all because Luigi U was just a DLC campaign for the Wii, the Wii U version. I don't know if I, I think I said that. So we got a silver medal. You get the drill. They're just getting the times. That's basically what this whole, um, this whole uh, category is about. New challenges are available, so you just keep doing that. You don't even need to get the best score to 
unlock more. They all have star ratings, by the way. These are one star challenges. All right, triple jump for coins. So yeah. By the way, these are not all in the games to see. It's his original course instead of Acorn Plains one. You gotta get the most coins. So let's just do it. Triple jump to get the most coins. There's no time. Well, there is a time limit, but the time limit doesn't affect your score. Seventy nine, which is a bronze score. You guys, guys get the gist. I'm, I'm pretty sure you're getting the gist. So. Coin theme challenges about collecting coins, which is pretty cool. Woo! <laughs> I need to make a new me, man. Mine looks nothing like me anymore. And also, it saves a replay movie so you can watch it yourself. So you can approve. I don't remember how to do that. Wait. I don't know. <laughs> All right, let's just do the uh, the Goombratch Stomp. So you get one on one up. That's um, that's two. Um, one on one, one, one up is bronze. Wow. <laughs> okay, that was really bad. One one up is bronze. Two is silver, and three is gold. What the fuck? Yo, I'm so ass right now. <laughs> How? I landed right in between. Oh my god. <sighs> Man. First gold? We got a bronze, silver, and gold. That's pretty nice. Gold medal. Save it. Save replay movie. Thank you. All right. Next category, which is special. Graceful glide. Let's do this. You have to... It's, it's a one-up challenge, basically. But, you have to get to the end. I think. Without... You know, okay, the difference is you can't touch the ground. Wait, why isn't this in the one-up category? This is a bad example. Wait, no. This is a really bad example of this category. Because it's literally a one-up. Let's see. This... The, the, if this one the one I think it is, then this is a good one. Yeah. Alright, so basically you have to dodge fireballs for 15 minutes. From the fire bros. Not 15 minutes, I, I meant 15 seconds. I wonder how long you can do this. I wonder what happens if I try to kill them. I'll go for it at the end. See, I kind of want to do that one again. That's that was a good example of the category. It's just obscure shit like that. Silver medal, nice. So yeah, you got a taste of all three categories. You got saw me get at least one of each medal. So yeah, I want to try. Actually, so this is how you view the replay. You can view the replay to see how you can improve. And it's just showing me the clip of that. You guys get the gist. That's so, if you want to learn how to improve, that's how you do that. Like, you can watch yourself. If you don't have, like, capture art or something, you know. So, that's a gist of all the challenges. You can change characters anytime, like in the main game, but... Oh, shit. How am I? I banged my, like, controller against the desk, like, three times. <laughs> Alright. Next is boost, boost Rush Mode. 
It's one player. It's up to four players, this mode. Toda and Nabbit are actually in this, but we're gonna save them for a different episode. We're gonna play with me again. And I'm gonna- this time no hat, no hat. New course packs are available. Okay, so basically the more you play the game, the more packs you unlock. These are packs. These packs have different star rankings, which is the difficulty. So we're just gonna do the easy one. And I'll explain to you. Th these are courses from the game. They're not original courses or anything like that. Um, so basically, it's an it's an auto scroll version of the um the course. But you see that meter below the time limit? The more coins you get, the more coins you get, the auto scroll speeds up. Crap. So basically, the, the more coins you get, the auto scroll sp speeds up. And when it's full, it goes really fast. That's what that meter means. Let's get in here. Look how fast we're going now. Music sounds really nice right now. Not a lot of people play this mode, huh? Oh shit. Oh no 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 no. I just- And if you die, like that, you go in a bubble, hit B to pop yourself. You can't pop yourself in multiplayer in the actual game, but in this one you can. Because you're kind of con- Not really- No, you're not really competing against each other. Also, if you die, your gauge goes down. That's why we're slower. Also, your me's appear in the background. That's Shrek. <laughs> That's a Shrek me. Oh my god. These are so many weird me's. I have a lot of weird me's on my Switch because I had a phase where I just was obsessed with making me's in Smash Ultimate. Like, I just loved making them. Like, based off characters from like shows and stuff. It's very weird. So yeah, okay. Now, we have- first course is done, we- it's basically the goal is to get as much coins as possible so the level speeds up and you can get a good time. That's pretty much the goal. I- I should have said that earlier. This is- you're pretty much just trying to get a good time. This- this one's an easy pack. So... Yeah. Even though these levels are easy, it's definitely a lot more harder knowing that it's faster. annoying so that was 1-1 the first level now we're uh... oh god you get a little boost of speed even if your meters at full no 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 We're almost at the end. Shit. Oh my god. You guys get the point of this mode. It says more courses are available because the more you play the story mode of Mario U, the more courses you'll get by the end. Which is pretty nice. <laughs> and this is our final score. Two deaths, no one-ups, and um... 80 coins. And now our this is easy pack, so now when we go through the easy pack, our high score should be on it. And it's just basically levels from the game like this. This one has three courses, this one has two. They're all different in the star levels above the name. Random's random, of course. One, two, three, four, four, five, and five. So yeah. That's pretty much that mode, and you can change characters anytime. You know. 
Also, I forgot to mention why Nabbit and Toad are not available because they're marked as easy and easier, which makes the challenges not as hard, which would, you know, which makes sense. All right, coin battle. This is a two player mode. Thank God I have my best friend left Joy-Con that's just gonna bubble the whole time. So we're just gonna do this. We're gonna go, I'll, let's both do me's. I'll play, no, I'll, cause I wanna show you that. Uh, Nab and Toad are in this mode as well. Even though you're competing, this time you're competing against each other. Uh, we'll do my dog. This is Shiro, my dog. He's not gonna wear a hat. Um, <laughs> so we're just gonna do this. Shiro's my dog's name, and that's where I got the name from. Okay, so there's actually coin battle courses. You could do random battles, which is basically a set, you know, of up to of three rounds minimum, I think. Wait, actually, can you learn that? No, you can't. Yeah, so three minimum of a set. So basically, these there's actually original courses, and you can do the Mario U story mode stuff, which is pretty cool. Can do all the worlds, which I don't. But the this level's a lot. This mode is a lot more fun in the coin courses that are meant for this. Let Let's just do this one. I'll explain. Okay. Also, the star rating is rating them how difficult they are. We'll just pick them up. So basically, we're fighting to get coins, and the star above your head is to telling you who's in the lead. Now, these coin courses are original, and they're actually pretty well designed, and this mode could actually, is really a lot of fun with, um, with, um, actual people, which, they should include a mode like this in Mario Maker, honestly, this would be a lot more, this would be a fun thing to do online. So we're just lifting this lifeless body breaking up. He got the checkpoint bonus because <laughs> I threw him at it. Um, you can also, you're basically going against each other. So this, I love this mode because you can just kill each other and it's understandable this time instead of just being salty because you're fighting. Sorry, you're gonna die. <laughs> Why is he not- I forgot the plants to come up on you. No! Okay. <laughs> Die. Die, dog. He's in a bubble. He- we have to pop him. So you can try to run away from him so you don't pop him, but it's pretty hard when they're spamming it. He got the one-up bonus. And it hit the P-switch. And he got higher on the fly pole, so he got more bonus points. And it's how he's on our coins at the end. So I got 66 and he got 41. Star coins are bonus. And bonus coins are from like 1-ups, the flag, and stuff like that. And how the fuck did he win? What the fuck happened? How the fuck did he win? Yo, what the fuck? Yo. <laughs> also, when you die, you lose a little coins. And now it says our score in the corner. So you keep, keep doing this and see how many around. Or you could do a set. Alright, so. You, also, you could do teams if you're playing with um, more than um, with four people. Which is pretty cool. Alright. Let's show, we have one more thing to show in this video. Coin editor, it's a one player mode. You, only on the coin original courses. So let's do the second one. Coin edit. You get to place where the coins go. Say so if you want to place the star coins, let's place the star coin right in the dead center. So you hit A. 
and you just go like, let's place all these coins. You can't get rid of existing coins. We'll just put them all over here. Let's put them in a position where it says high. And it's just... You hit A on it again, it goes away. It's actually pretty cool. This came out before Mario Maker, technically, so it's very weird. I don't know why you would want to do this, honestly. Because I feel like it's a lot more fair if the coins... If the, the developers put the coins places. Cause, so you can't, like, cheat and know where all the, like, know where all them are. Like, you can't be like, okay, let's say we spawn right here and I put all the coins over here. I don't know if we spawn there. And he, d he spawns here and there's like nothing. Like, that's bullshit, in my opinion. I think this is where you spawn. This is why these X's are here. Okay, cool. You guys get it. So let's just put... Let's just put all these star coins... Let's just put them like that. Yeah, let's put them right there. And let's save our creation. Continue. And let's just... Let's just quit. Wait, no. So we saved our creation. We quit out of this mode. We're back here. We're back in the coin edit menu. Let's place- we can go hop right into coin battle. We're gonna do another round of it. Um... Cause why not? Do two players again? Let's just do Mario and Luigi cause... These are the real kings of this thing. You, I, you guys seen my ugly ass me's enough. So let's play this episode- this one. Let's do- you could do this one, which is the one that's not edited, but, or we can do the edited version. So let's just do that. So, I just got one, because I kicked him. This stage is pretty cool, you can loop around. And if you both die, the act the round cancels and it's a draw on automat automatically, even though Luigi got more coins. So yeah, that's pretty much all I had to show you guys today. Let's go back to the menu. So yeah, that's the play with me section. Thank you guys for watching the first bonus episode of New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe. That's been a good one. It's been a good one. Next time, we're gonna go in-game and show- and do a little stuff, you know. That's where we're gonna show you Nabbit, Toadette, and other gameplay stuff. Stuff that are related to these campaigns. And then- the next video is going to be everything else. The third video is going to be pretty much everything else. So yeah. See you guys then. Bye.